to my channel and happy Halloween. Today is Halloween. So we are going to go trick or treating this evening, but right now it is 9.15. So we are heading out. I needed to go to Target to get a few things. So I decided I would take JJ to the children's museum and let him play for a little while. It is so cold. Like literally it's freezing right now, but I thought it would be fun to get out a little bit. We haven't really been doing much the past few days. We went to a trunk or treat event last night. So we were out last night doing that. But other than that, we've kind of just been in the house all week because it's just been so cold and I just haven't really felt like going out and doing anything with JJ by myself. So I just thought it'd be fun to get out this morning, go run a few errands, let JJ play a little bit. And then later we will go trick or treating. If you guys are new to my channel, I would love it if you would subscribe and join my YouTube family. I will be 37 weeks pregnant tomorrow with our first baby girl. And I also have a 19 month old son named JJ. He's back there. I'm not even like exaggerating guys. It is 33 degrees right now. So cold. Say hi, say hi. So we just got back home. I stopped at Subway and grabbed us some lunch. So we're about to sit down and eat right now. JJ's playing with all of his cars on the table. But I really just got like a bunch of snacks for JJ while I was at Target, so. Nothing too exciting, just some essentials that we needed. But yeah, so we are going to eat right now. I am like so worn out from just getting JJ in and out of the car and walking around. It always wears me out. So I'm probably just going to relax a little bit while he naps. Yeah, here. Yeah. So after we eat, he's gonna go down for a nap and then I'll probably just relax a little bit. And then when he gets up, it'll be just about time to get ready to go trick or treating later. JJ got a little slider sandwich with salami, cheese, and tomato on it. And then I got the chicken bacon ranch. It looks so good. He's such a big boy, JJ. He ate everything except his bread. All his cheese, salami, and his tomato. I'm so proud of him. You gonna eat some of your bread? <laughs> You guys, I am literally dying right now. JJ is so stinking cute. I was washing some dishes. We had like a few dishes in the sink, so I was just putting those into the dishwasher. And he went and picked up his bowl that was in the living room. He had cereal in it this morning, so it was empty. But he went in the living room and grabbed the bowl and brought it to me so that I could put it in the dishwasher. Like, what baby does that? He's so cute. So JJ is up from his nap now. Pretty much the entire time that he napped, I was editing my what's in my hospital bag video so that it could go up tomorrow. So pretty much this whole nap, I was editing and uploading that. But he got up, I gave him a snack, and he's watching cartoons right now while I was getting everything ready to go. I had to get some clothes to take to Fred so that he can change. We're going trick or treating on post because we live in an apartment complex, so we can't really trick or treat here. So we're gonna go on post with some of our friends. We went with them last year as well. But I just finished like getting everything ready to go. I packed some snacks for JJ. We're gonna go eat dinner at Qdoba on post, but I don't know if JJ's gonna eat anything or not. So just in case I packed him like a pouch and some goldfish and things like that. But I'm about to get him all ready in his costume right now. I will show you guys me getting him ready and all that. And then we are going to head out. I'm just kind of taking a second and catching my breath again from just walking around the apartment getting everything ready.
we just got on post. We are at Fred's work right now, waiting for him to come out and he's going to change clothes really quick and then we're gonna go eat dinner. JD's back there. He's so stinking cute. He is so cute, but I am glad that this is our last time like having to dress him up. We did something over the weekend where I got him in his costume and then we went to a trunk or treat last night and I am just like over this costume right now because it is so cute but it is so messy like the hair color and and the makeup stuff for his face it's just such a mess and I am like over it so I'm really glad that this is our last time having to get dressed up in this costume but I'm really excited to take him trick-or-treating I think it's gonna be so much more fun this year now that he's really old enough to kind of understand what's going on last year was super fun too because he was a baby and he was so stinking cute but I think this year is gonna be even more fun now that he can walk around and go get the candy himself and all that. So I'm excited for that. And he's in his little overalls, but I did put him in two long sleeve shirts. So he's got another one under his, under the orange one that you can see. He's got another one so that he stays warm. And I also grabbed a pair of sweatpants that I think I'm gonna put on him under his overalls just because like it's supposed to get into the 40s again once the sun goes down around six o'clock. So I don't want him to be like freezing cold the whole time. And I also got him gloves too, so that I can put the gloves on him so that he's not that cold either. We are ready to get bundled up and I'm just really excited. What are you smiling at? I think he sees Fred. Do you see Dada? Yeah. We just got home and there is a huge box from Grove. So we're gonna open that up. I ordered a bunch of cleaning supplies. I already know it's in it obviously, but I'm so excited. Ooh. Okay, so here is everything that I got. I just have it laid out on the kitchen table and we have our bags because we just got back home, so ignore all that. But I got this Baby Gannix hand sanitizer. I'm gonna put this probably in my diaper caddy just so I have it handy every time I change her diaper. I got some of the Method Squirt and Mop. I love using this on our floors and we're running low, so I grabbed another one. This one's Lemon Ginger. I got one of the Method Daily Shower Sprays. I got some baking soda because I wanna mix baking soda and vinegar and deep clean a couple areas and we don't have any baking soda so I just grabbed that while I was ordering everything else. I got this Baby Gannix toy and high chair cleaner. I thought this would be really good for JJ's toys and for her like teething toys and all that and then I don't have to worry about them if they put it in their mouths. I can just use this on it and it'll be all good. I got a one of these glass spray bottles with the silicone sleeve on them and it came with a glass cleaner. This is the orange and rosemary and this is just the Grove Collaborative brand. I've never used our glass cleaner before, so we'll see how I like that one. I got the seventh generation all-purpose cleaner. It's just a free and clear scent. I'm probably gonna keep this in the bathroom to use to clean the bathroom. I've never used this before. This thing is gigantic, like it's 23 ounces, but this is huge for like an all-purpose cleaner. But I'm really excited to try this one out and see how I like it. And then also for the bathroom, I got this disinfecting bathroom cleaner. This is by seventh generation as well. And it's the lemongrass citrus scent. And then I got some Mrs. Meyer stuff. So I got the Mum Scented Multi-Surface Spray and the Mum Scented Dish Soap. And those I'm gonna be using right now. I have the Acorn Spice one right now and I'm almost out, so I will start using those. And then I got this set of the Christmas scent. This is the Iowa Pine. I used this last year and I absolutely loved it. So I got the Multi-Surface Spray, Dish Soap, and Hand Soap. This came in like a set of all three of them for like $10, I think, which is a really good deal because if you buy them in store, they're like $4 each. So a little bit cheaper than buying them separate at the store. And then the last thing I got were these Walnut Scrubber Sponges. These are my absolute favorite sponges and they always put them in the order for free whenever you order from Grove. So 
really excited to have some of these again because we just ran out probably like a month or so ago. And I've been using some other ones and I don't like them as much as these. So I'm glad I have some more of these. But yeah, so that was everything that I got from Grove. Really excited to try out some of these new cleaning products. And we are like all stocked up to do a deep clean in the apartment and then just have everything we need for a few months because I don't want to be like running out of anything when she's here because I want to keep everything clean obviously and sanitized really well. But we obviously are back home now. JJ is in bed. I gave him a bath and put him to bed like right when we got home because it was already eight o'clock. So he needed to go down and he was so tired. He had a lot of fun though. He was so funny. He just wanted to ride in our friend's wagon. And so he would ride in the wagon and then anytime we would get up to a house and stop, he would get out and go get candy and then go get back in the wagon. And it was the cutest thing ever. And I think he had a lot of fun. It was nice being out. I didn't get that much footage because it got dark pretty much like right when we started trick or treating. So you couldn't even see anything on the camera. So that's why there's not really any footage of us trick or treating. I tried to get a little bit though. So we'll see how it like turns out once I upload it and all that. But I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I'm going to go lay down. I got a hot chocolate on the way home. So I'm going to drink that and just relax because it has been a long and busy day. But I hope you guys had a great Halloween as well with you and your family trick or treating or doing whatever you guys did for Halloween. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.